So let's actually do a problem and see how this all fits together. All right. We're asked to compute, compute the equation of the tangent plane and upward pointing normal vector to the graph of this function of two variables at this particular point. Okay? So the first thing we do is calculate the normal vector. All right? Now what do I mean when I say upward pointing? Well, essentially we mean that the k component must be positive. Okay? If the k component of the normal vector was negative, then it would be classed as downward pointing. And if it's zero, then well, it's neither upward pointing nor downward pointing. All right, so... Upward pointing. All right, so... It's going to be this form. Note that the k component is positive, and all I really need to do is work out these partial derivatives and evaluate them at our point. Okay? So, what is the partial derivative of f with respect to x at this point? Well, we go up here, we differentiate with respect to x, and imagine everything else is a constant. So, if we differentiate with respect to x, we'll get minus 2x. And we want to evaluate that at x equals 1, y equals 2. Okay, so we plug that in and we'll get minus 2. Okay? Okay, similarly, f sub y well, we go up here, differentiate with respect to y partially by holding x fixed, and we're going to get this. So we uh, substitute in x equals 1, there's no x's here, y equals 2, and we'll get minus 4. Now we want to take the negatives of these, so we, it's going to be 2, 4, and 1. Okay, so we've calculated the normal vector. Now we're just after the, the equation of the tangent plane. So let's go back to our equation for the tangent plane, and um, we can just substitute in. So the equation of tangent plane is the following. Okay, it's going to be f sub x at 1, 2 times x minus 1 plus f sub y at 1, 2 times y minus 2 minus z minus f at 1, 2. And this is all equal to 0. Okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to sub in here and here for my derivatives at, a, at our point, and then um, the last thing to do is actually work this out. So basically I'm just substituting in here. All right, so we're going to get minus 2, x minus 1, minus 4, y minus 2, minus z. Uh, okay, so f at 1, 2, if I go up here, sub in x equals 1, y equals 2, I'll get 4. So this is the equation then 
of my tangent plane. Okay? Now, um, you can clean this up a bit, of course, and rearrange it, but I'm just going to leave it in this form because I've just about run out of room at the bottom of the page.